And similarly, a Pueblo State Governor, Pastor Umo Eno, has expressed his heartfelt appreciation for the support shown him by his colleagues and compassionate Nigerians as he mourns the passing of his wife. The late pastor missed his passions, Eno. Speaking during a condolence visit from the Southern Governor's Forum at the Government House in Uyo, Pastor Eno characterized their gestures as warm and comforting, noting that he and his family have found strength in the outpouring of love. Reflecting on the life of his late wife, Pastor Mrs. Patience Eno, the governor emphasized that she had led a successful and fulfilling life over their 38 years together. He described her as a remarkable achiever and a woman of great faith, noting that she has been a tremendous blessing to both their family and the state as a whole. This is a, a lifetime mourning. It's not something you can put a closure because at every time you turn, you will always find out that there is a missing link. And um, we've been together for 40 years, two years of courtship, 38 years of marriage. And um, you just begin to wonder She's the only one that understands me, understands me too well. The consolation is that she had done things that our memories and legacies will live on. And that's why one of the things that the Holy Spirit quickly put in my mind was to get a daughter who had, of course, been a PA all through the campaigns, all of, to quickly begin to coordinate the office. Um, because of the work she has started, I'm more interested in keeping memory of those work, uh, pet projects and all of that sustained. Speaking on behalf of the group, the chairman and governor of Ogun State, Dr. Dakbo Abiodun, encouraged the governor, first family and entire people of the state to be consoled by the good life the first lady lived, assuring that the firm will continue to stand by the governor through the difficult time. We know that Pastor Patience was your, not just your wife, she was your praying partner. She was your friend. She was your companion. She was your sounding board. We can only pray that the Almighty God, who we cannot question, our God is a God of all seasons. He's the one that knows the end from the beginning. He's the one that has created us in his likeness. And when things like this happen, as mere mortals, we are, of course, very pained. We attempt to question the Almighty God. But we are reminded that he does not owe us an explanation. 